Last year, more than 116 million piglets died because their moms accidentally laid on and crushed them. And this resulted in the loss of over $4.1 billion to the pork industry. In my time as a farrowing manager, I was able to personally experience this pain point and realize that if I wanted to solve this problem, I was gonna have to find a way to do it myself. So I put together a team, went to the World Pork Expo and interviewed farmers from all over the world. There we found that 92% of producers are actively looking for a solution to this problem. So we asked them what they wanted to see in a product and delivered on exactly what they asked for. Our patent pending technology, SmartGuard, can accurately identify when a piglet is getting crushed by analyzing the wavelengths and frequencies of each and every one of their squeals. We use acoustic engineering, proprietary algorithms, and machine learning to filter and detect whether or not a piglet is in distress. When we detect that piglet in distress, we communicate to a lightweight wearable placed on the sow's chest, which will initiate a gentle impulse or vibration, alerting her to stand up and allowing that little piglet to run free. Now, in addition to our anti-crushing technology, we provide farmers with a swine management feature which creates real-time reports and provides actionable insights to help them better understand their sow's health. We are essentially the Fitbit for pigs. In our most recent field trials, we've seen a 74% success rate. So for only $1,000 a unit, a farmer can place this device, oversee two sows at once, then move it after four to six days to another litter. This allows them to use the device on up to 180 sows per year, giving them that three to one return on investment they're looking for. Currently, the market for anti-crushing technology is just over $6 billion, and Swine Tech is perfectly positioned to become the big data, internet of things, wearable technology provider for farmers, where we can become the Fitbit for pigs, help isolate disease, and become a data source for companies like Bayer and Pfizer.